friends welcome to this video today we will see some examples based on the commutative property of rational numbers in the previous video we learned that the sum and the multiplication of rational numbers are commutative but the subtraction and division are not commutative come let's see what is happening in this class children look carefully and tell which of these options is correct all of you solve these questions sir we can multiply rational numbers in any order therefore the first option is correct absolutely correct what do you think about the second option sir the second option is wrong because the subtraction of rational numbers is not commutative we can see here the answer on the lhs is 1 by 4 and the answer on rhs is minus 1 by 4 but sir the third option is correct the answer on lhs is 29 by 20 and the answer on rhs is also 29 by 20 this is because the sum of rational numbers is commutative and the fourth option is wrong we can see here the answer on the lhs is 5 by 6 and the answer on rhs is 6 by 5 it is not equal they are reciprocal of each other Sohan your answer is correct but what do you think about the last option Sir if we look at the left side that is LHS then we can write square root of 9 is equal to 3 and square root of 25 is equal to 5 in this way we can write square root of 9 by 25 as 3 by 5 Now we can write LHS as follows which is equal to 3 by 5 multiplied by 7 by 4 we know that the multiplication of rational numbers is commutative so we can also write 3 by 5 multiplied by 7 by 4 as 7 by 4 multiplied by 3 by 5 because changing the order will not change the answer we can see that in our option LHS is equal to RHS That is the last option is correct Children now fill in the blanks All of you try solving this question Sir the answer to this question is 11 by 9 How did you get that Mohan Sir in this question we have to find a number that when multiplied by the square root of 4 by 3 gives an answer equal to the product of 11 by 9 and 2 by 3 the square root of 4 is 2 so we can write it this way we can also write the given question as solve it now we know that the multiplication of rational numbers is commutative so if we write 11 by 9 on the blank space here we can see that the left side is equal to the right side that is our answer is 11 by 9 children in this video we saw examples related to commutative property of rational numbers that's all in this session thank you